Hey there, guys, and welcome to Amnesia the Bunker. Um, I'm a little late to this party. It's, I'm a little late to the Amnesia party, actually. I'd, um, uh, I've only played about 20 minutes of uh, The Dark Descent, uh, and that was a, a while back. Uh, I missed the train whenever it was a big deal, you know. Um, uh, whenever, you know, that one small creator uh, was, was capitalizing on the Amnesia horror train. Uh, when that thing started getting big, if you know, you know, if you know, you know. <laughs> but um, yeah. Uh, so I mean, I I uh, I wanted to give this a shot, see how it, see how it is, you know. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and and run through a new game. I kind of started one up just to kind of tweak my settings a little bit, but we're gonna go ahead and run through this and see what it's like. <clears throat> to survive this war, you'll need two things: first, a basic set of skills; second, the good goddamn sense to do whatever is necessary. I can teach you the first, the second is up to you. Yeah, World War One sounds like a fun time. I think that's the setting for this. Yeah, World War One. You're in the uh, trenches. So I've seen some of this just to kind of get, get my settings down, but I haven't seen much past this. What is this? Oh yeah, I forget, you can just kind of throw things. Bring out the gun, hold the grab, meaning, cool, cool. I don't know, man. Uh, World War in any era, my buddy, doesn't seem like a fun time, especially this one. It's super muddy, super nasty in these things. I'm gonna go ahead and close this door behind me, but. <coughs> Yeah, hopefully this video turns out better than my last video because, okay, got some bullets. Go ahead and load those up in there. That one bullet out of this entire box. Go ahead and load that one in there too. Um, yeah, uh, the, the Observer video, um, I just went ahead and played it pretty much all in one sitting. There might have been a day in between, but I just cut it into one big video. And uh, the video was not exactly fit to the screen. It, it was shrank a little, and that's unfortunate. After a few years of doing this off and on now, you'd think I would be better at uh, editing and recording and things like that, but I am not. <laughs> there we go. That's pretty cool. I like the uh, physics of this game. I remember being able to throw things around, you know, and the, uh, and the the little bit of Dark Descent that I did play, but I just remember getting to a specific point and immediately saying no, nope, because it's pretty scary, even for that time. So, hopefully... Okay, yeah. Oh, God, ow. Ow. What am I supposed to do here? Can I just clean? No, I need to pull that back out, please. I'm gonna shoot you. Well, I'm out of bullets. I don't know what they're saying. I don't know. I don't know German. No kind of. No kind of. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it, buddy. I'm Henri. Okay. Hi. Tab. I got shot in the leg. Pretty bad, I guess. It's never a good sign. You know, bleeding blood. Bleeding my own blood, specifically. It's never a good thing. I'm gonna go ahead and close you. Lock it up. Shit. Picked up an item that can be used for crafting. Pick up a, the other cloth piece. Press tab. To access inventory. Okay. Drop. Aha. Hold down and use. I'm gonna wrap myself up in a bandage pair. All better. You know. It's just a bullet lodged in my leg, but it's okay. 
Yeah, we'll crawl under here. All right. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take those. I mean, you could you could just probably make a a game about the war, and that's scary enough. Just kind of make it realistic. You know, there's a movie, an older movie called Come and See, I think, about the horrors of war, basically. Uh, young man, I think it was World War II, though, it was the setting. It was like a, a young kid wanted to join up, and they got more than he bargained for. Um, never actually seen the entire thing, but we're, we're, am I supposed to throw one of these in it? Okay. Seems like a waste. I'd be able to find something that could just get through the door, but I guess I could. The ringing. I could throw a shoulder into it. You know, that's effective as well. Let's see. Just. Ooh. Bullet. Let's go ahead. Hey, we got three bullets. Pop them in there, for sure. In case the Germans come back. Red barrel. Can't do that Might as well. See a red barrel, you gotta shoot it. Even though... Uh, I should be... Oh shit. I should be conserving my fucking shit. My, oh my goodness. I should be conserving my... Uh... Oh god. I gotta go. Oh shit. Am I dead? Well, that didn't take long, did it? <laughs> I'm stuck in the mustard here. Lambert. Thank you. This is disorienting. Um, I forgot what I was saying. Go figure. Drink my coffee in my lovely, colorful cup. It's not mine. Repeat that roll, my friend. There you have We're playing it, some man. dice. Fates of bastard. See la vie. All right. Well, we made it out of the trench with our hello. Uh, well, with the help of our friend Lambert. And uh, now we're in the fucking. Now we're really in the shit because we're not in the safety of a trench. Hello? It's a flare down there. How am I good? Yeah, it could be scary enough, like I was saying, you know, just the horrors of war, but apparently it goes uh, a little deeper than that in this game. Obviously, there's always that amnesia um, twist to things. Cats are dumb. Oh boy. I'm going to get you out of here. Sorry, Lambert or Harry, Harry Potter. You kind of look like Harry Potter. Can we just like separate out of here? Flu powder, flu network anywhere? Digging, grunting. Heaving, hoisting. And these dudes are young too. That that's I'll get you back to safety. Crazy. Just hold on to me. And not much has changed, you know. And Henri, did you climb that rope with this dude on your back? You're a fucking machine, my dude. Just hanging out. All right, I guess. Oh fuck! Schnell! Oh no! Bob and weave. Bob and weave. Oh fuck! I probably should have just left him behind. I think I just got him killed. I mean, I don't know how that worked. Were they have just taken him prisoner, or were they just? 
You are on your own now. Learn, adapt, experiment, and survive. Great. I hope this isn't too... Um, this isn't too reliant upon resource management. Because I am not the greatest at resource management. We're going to find out, though. So. Move that a little closer to my face there. Oh boy. Well, here we are. Who put, who, bro who brought me here? Is the question. Grenade went off. There were Germans behind us. Dog. And they must have just assumed that I was dead. Because why wouldn't I be? Okay. It's very, very dark. And I know I'm playing this in broad daylight. Uh, but... You know, this is really the only time that I have to play these things anymore. Having a a uh, one-year-old will kind of kind of do that to you. I can't record in the middle of the night, really. I mean, I can, but I'll have to be very quiet, like I've done in a few of my other videos. Soldat Clement admitted to I don't am I saying that right? Soldat. Uh, admitted to medical treatment following events of 9th July. Personal effects held in the storage locker. Patient remains in weak coma state. Will respond to stimuli, but only for brief periods of time. When last roused, he reported no memory of recent events. Had trouble recalling even his own name. Most likely due to severity of initial head trauma. Will continue to monitor. If status does not improve in a week's time, recommend transfer to St. Etienne. Etienne for a neurological test signed. Dr. Josinski. Alright, Doctor. Copy that. Yeah, like I was saying, I, you know, I, I know I'm playing in broad daylight, but... Uh, I still get scared uh, playing these games, even in broad daylight. Let's see, I'll just go ahead and open these. I will say that the opening and closing and gathering of things is much more responsive than it was in Observer. Sometimes even opening a drawer in that game was kind of a task, but... Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be doing this in one sitting. This might be a few videos. I say that, but... Okay. I, uh, I haven't been the most reliable whenever it comes to finish. Hello? Finishing games. Hence the reason I revisited Observer so long after I... Flashlight. Ah. Hold down to charge flashlight, but don't make too much noise. Oh, I have to charge it? Oh, God. That's a very weak beam. It's on a damn timer. <clears throat> I'm in a... 9th of July. Oh. 1700 hours. I'm in a state of agony. It cripples my body, captures my mind, bleeds my soul. This thing I have done, this thing, this thing. It is lunch in the mess hall currently. Oh, the thought of eating repulses me. Well, Ennui. I mean, you just made it out of a sticky situation and... More than likely got yourself in an even stickier situation, which is unfortunate. Okay. Just my luck. What did I do to deserve this? What did Ennui do to deserve this, man? He probably didn't even want to be here. Yeah, you know, young dudes get drafted and have to experience the hills of war firsthand. Well, hello, knock knock. All right, Miss Hall. Well, it ain't lunch no more. Hello. Yeah, there's a hole in the wall. What's that for? Multiple holes. Blood. Hello. Ah. Yes. Hey. No. Apparently not. What is this? Meat? 
exit behind them. Huh. What'd they do that for? You want to escape. You need, you need to blow it back open. There's, there's dynamite in the arsenal. Ah, and a handle to trigger it somewhere in the excavation site. Okay. Get them, and you can make it out. Shit. Oh, that thing, it's coming for me. Here, here. Take this. What? Finish me off. Peace. I want to die at the hands of a border soldier, not that monster. Okay. There's ammo in the pantry. Get it. Dude, can't do the job, please. All you gotta do is, you know, put two pieces of cloth together and wrap yourself up. You're, you'll be good as gold, good as gold, right as rain. I'm gonna carry this meat. I don't know why. Okay. Well, there is a monster. Hello. Yeah. Okay, I got some bullets. Shush. My cat's being dumb. Again. Go figure. <laughs> She's good at that. Uh. Okay, buddy. Oh, fucking shit. Uh, buddy. That's fucked up. That was probably... I'm just going to block that. Um, I think I would have rather to bullet as well. Just saying. Instead of getting pulled into a hole in ways that I don't exactly bend. But now what? God. And I gotta keep quiet. Anything around here? Holy shit. Alright. Oh fuck. Now that's the way we... Wait. That's a lock. I can pop the lock. Or I can go... No, I can't go in here. Okay. Yeah. There's not really any other way around, is there? Let me just be doubly sure that I didn't miss anything in here. Alright, let's see. I guess we'd have to pop the pop the lock. Oh, hello. Now how much what is this? How much noise does that make? Ah oh, shit. Oh. Is that just from war? <laughs> or is that from something else? A letter. <clears throat> Body of Saint Sergeant Saint. Body of Sergeant Renard. Multiple lacerations, chest cavity torn to shreds, every rib cracked, skull cracked open by repeated blunt force trauma. Who could have done this to him? Well, Get over here, please. I think I have an idea, and it lives in a hole in the b b b b b bunker. What am I seeing? What am I looking at? Holy shit! What's that? Oh, just a fuel can. Petrol. So you're just like burning people in here? Yikes. Oh god, it's so dark. The sun shining onto my screen. There's a lot of light in this room, so it doesn't really help. But, uh, so this is where it came from, right? Yeah, I can't go back this way. That's where it, wait, woke up. And the light's out. Fucking great. Okay. I gotta pop the lock off of that door, I guess. Let's pop it. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's, in, it's this way. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. What's that? 
Just a pencil. Please tell me you're alive. You are. What is... Oh! Great. That one's already locked. What do we have here? V. Batiste. Okay. Important. When processing deceased soldiers, please check the reverse side of their ID tags for any messages, symbols, or locker codes. These will be wiped clean before the tag is preserved and recorded. Okay, so they'll have some codes on them. Anything? It's great. You can save progress by lighting this lamp. Dude, it's a Dark Souls. It's a fucking bonfire. Oh, is this a safe room? Yeah, this is like Dark Souls, Resi 4 safe rooms, or just Resident Evil in general. Nice. Storing things. Like meat. And a bubble in my throat. Meat. We'll put our meat in there. I don't know, uh. I don't know what that's gonna be for, uh, but. I feel safe in here. The music is. Update to all medical and mortuary personnel. The rat problem is not getting any better. They're swarming every dead body. They're even coming after the wounded, but the vermin have no interest in flesh after it's burnt. Oh, so that's why they, they burnt them. So a new policy must be instituted. The bodies of all deceased soldiers must be burned. I have spoken to Father De Ray, De Ray about this matter. He'll provide proper consecration for the deceased. Remains will be preserved for families. This is not ideal, and it fills my soul with pain. But burning the dead seems to be the only way to stop the rats from coming. So burn them. We must. I mean, fair enough, I guess. Do what you gotta do. Can we wind this bad boy up here? Musical records. Put on some tunes. No. Nothing. Oh! What we have here? Goddamn nothing. What's, why is it locked? No latch needed. Alright, I guess we're going into this abyss. Oh boy. Yeah. Generator. Hello. Another note. These people like to write. Generator fuel is flammable. Do not light any fires near the fuel. Do not fire any weapons near the fuel. For God's sakes, don't even smoke your cigarettes near it. Store it only in sturdy metal canisters. Glass breaks far too easily. If it spills, wipe the area clean immediately. Dispose of the rags. Okay. Cool. I could have told you that. Is there fuel in here? Oh, there is. Wait. I don't know. It's just a barrel. Also, I got fuel. Power the generator by filling it with fuel and pulling the lever. Fair enough. It says, I can watch. More fuel. Uh, hey, pal. You've been eaten by rats yet? You've been dead for a minute, huh? Looks like it. Freelu. 1481. Any codes written down? Okay. Uh, cool. How do I do you? Hold down, use. Up she goes. Fill her up. Is that both my cans? It was, okay. Uh. Ah, beautiful. Hold down, right trigger to get it close. Right mouse button. Oh, okay, so I kind of sinks up. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got a we got a time limit. I got to find dynamite apparently. Or a plunger for it. Okay. So that's where I came and now I just anyone out there? I'm burning light. Let's see. Oh, hey, map. That's where I'm at. What did he say? Actually, hang on. Oh, do I not have like a objective? Great. I need to get to the arsenal, I guess. 
that seems like a good place to be, right? Like a plunger for some... What was the code? God damn it, sorry. 1481. No, don't do that. One, four, eight, one. Aha! I don't know why I'm so proud of this. I don't wanna I don't wanna come out here. Overcome most obstacles in multiple ways. Use your wits, something. I couldn't read that fast enough. Maintenance, arsenal. Everything's this way anyway, but the exit is over here, so let's take a peek. What's that? Water? Water skin? Something like that. Alright. Okay, here's the box to blow the exit. I've not seen another human for hours now. I might be the last, but in the hopes that there might be another, I leave this now so you do not waste any time. This is the only exit, the only way out of this hell of our own making. It was blown closed. It needs to be blown open. Don't bother digging. Impossible. Blow it up. The dynamite is locked in the arsenal. The detonator handle is somewhere down in the Roman tunnels. Deeper in hell. Of course, because why wouldn't it be? I go now to try and retrieve them both. Though I do not know if you exist, I pray for you. Please extend me the same courtesy. Okay, so arsenal, that's easy enough, but where are Roman tunnels? New objective, objections will be marked on your maps, and notes containing objectives will be highlighted in the note list. Okay. Alright, copy that. Uh, do I have a map? I don't have a map. Not yet, anyhow. So, need the dynamite. Good lord, man. I would... I am sorry, but I could squeeze through that. There's no way I would be fucking delving into this shit to try and find a, a plunger and some dynamite. I would just be out. Empty bottle. I'll take it. Whatever. So, yeah, arsenal. Uh... Soldiers, quarters, mission, storage, communications, prison. So we'll go. We'll try and go to the arsenal, I guess. Arsenal, soldiers, quarters. A big explosive barrel. What the fuck does this do? What is this? Oh! Lights! Beautiful. Okay. Anything around the corner here? No. Okay. Oh! Well, how do I lift the lockdown? Surely that barrel won't do anything. Hubert. Oh shit. Oh, oh, beautiful. I'm gonna need that. More monster stuff. That's great. I love it. <clears throat> Let's see. 14th July 1916 night. Strange scratching sounds a few moments ago and now it sounds like someone is pacing in the hallway. I just heard that. Probably Renard, drunk on the stash of wine. I knew I'd from us best I could front him now. I'll either get him into bed to sleep it off or convince him to share a bottle or two with me. 15th. Cold fear runs through all our veins now. Fournier has terrorized the men for answers. They say they were asleep until Renard screamed. I believe them, of course. Fournier went so far as to accuse prisoner, prisoner rather, 73014, uh, of escaping his cell and committing the murder. Impossible. I worry about Fournier. His rage hides fear. He takes it out on the men, and I can see no way to stop it. It breeds contempt. My mind slips back to the moment Renard started screaming. How easily it could have been me. How easily it still could be. For the first time, I wish the order to attack would come. I would rather face a thousand German guns in this nameless dread. Yeah. Same. Either that or I would rather squeeze my way out. To any of find this Fournier, our commanding officer, cowers next to me now. He lost his mind to an abyss of fear. He repeats the same refrain over and over. Flee, flee. We must flee and seal the beast where it belongs. He wants to run, to blow up the exit behind him, sealing the demon down here, the demon and our men. His constant refrain is getting to me. In that same void of terror, <coughs> it is also overtaking me. 
to any of my men who see this, once we're free of this place, I will get the arsenal code from him. I will get it, and I will radio it back to you. Trapped down here with that beast, the arsenal may be our only hope. Your only hope. It's all I can do. All I have courage to do. Get to the communications room in the soldier quarters. Hide there. I'll broadcast the code to you. Communications and soldiers' quarters. Oh. Okay. One thing at a time, fellas. Jesus. I can only do so much. Can I crawl under here? Is there any way to hide under a bed? No? Okay. Well, wreck it. Anything else in here? Another empty bottle. Let me just check my inventory, actually. It's getting kind of getting kind of cramped in here. So even if I find the fucking... Oh, shit. It's dark. Stuff. Hello? So we're back here. Actually... I don't have long at all, do I? Nope. Sure. Strategic operations. I am... Wasting time. Okay. Copy that. 2nd of May, Fournier and De Blanchette. Engineers have broken through our storage area and into the old Roman tunnels. They are, as we thought, structurally sound, deep, and I confess was skeptic. I was confessed. I confess I was skeptical uh, of this last point, but they go indeed, do indeed lead into the direction of the German line, but September we should have a position on this. So in storage, they found old Roman tunnels. Okay. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, it's a lot of blood. And I can't carry this. Of course. Hey, there's another explosive barrel. That doesn't... And more fuel. God. After raid uh, last evening, we were having a custody some twenty German soldiers for the the uh, seventy three zero one four. Okay. Okay. So that's that prisoner they were talking about that they thought escaped. Oh, there's a hole in the wall, and I don't like things that come out of the holes in the wall in this game. A flare. Oh, shit. I need to go ooh, dump some stuff. Can I go this way? Uh, I need to go dump some stuff. Reynard. Can't open that. I bet you. Oh, you know what? what oh, shit. Oh, you fucker. Hello. Oh boy. You fucking with me right now? Eh. Eh. Fuck you. So many notes. How do you have time to write so much? After Trembley's death, the bunker descended into chaos. I've taken control and ordered the men to form it up in squads or to hunt the beast down and kill it. They tell me it's not possible. They tell me the bullets don't kill it. They only buy a little time and the beast comes back angrier cowards. I've sent them back out now to do as they should. Hunt and kill it. If they fail, they'll face a worse fate than claws in the darkness. I don't know about that, buddy. Uh, clearly, it's like, you know, poking the bear here. That's a grenade. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm probably not doing this right. I've ordered increased security, blah, blah, blah. I use lock and code, and I will root out those responsible. Okay, buddy. Hey, there's a doll. That's nice. Another photo. And that's a hand. Separate from... Oh, there's the watch. Dude, I am fucking cutting it close. Okay. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Where did I come from? <laughs> Right, I can't, uh, I can't run. Alright, so let me go back to my room. Eh. Oh, God. Let's just go ahead and pop that. Soldiers' quarters. Arsenal. 
main map of the bunker will be updated with objectives and details as you as you progress. Okay, cool. So, uh, let me pop these in here because I don't know how much I'll need these right now. Soldiers' quarters. I need to get to soldiers' quarters and the arsenal, amongst other things. And I only have one can of fuel at the moment. I need to go back and get that other one. Maybe I'll try and run around just the flashlight and shit at the moment. And my gun. Okay. I need to pop some fuel in there and uh, go retrieve some extra fuel. Dude, this is so fucked up. Uh, oh no. Do not make noise. Don't. Don't get him to come over here. Shit. Where was the can? <laughs> I don't know if this is the best idea. De La Salle. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Oh, bro, can I not? What? Why can't I disarm that? Holy tits. Okay. Hang on. I'm just gonna crank that flashlight every now and again instead of fucking charging it up like crazy. Fournier. Oh, here we go. Here's where I was. A little bit ago. The fuel can wasn't in here. I'm just gonna close that. Crank it. There was fuel in here, though. Oh shit! Where are you? Sure, take it to cloth. There, there you are. Okay. Holy shit. Uh. It's so dark. <laughs> I fucking... I feel like I... Wait, there was something in there. That was the one I... Lounge, okay, and that's the way back. Pots and stuff? Oh shit. Hey. Okay. Shit. Uh, excuse me? Um. I don't want to. I do not want to. I'm gonna wait until the lights are back on before I go in there. Just gotta remember where it is. Okay. Because I'm gonna have to toss a grenade in there or something. Another locked door. I'm gonna have to toss something in there to blow the fucking thing up or one of those barrels or something. No, 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 no. Pull it out. I'm panicking. I'm gonna have to give it two cranks this time. Where am I? This is back at the mess hall, okay. Kind of got... Okay. I said okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh, well, since... Oh, fuck. Well, since I'm here... I'm gonna go... Dump this can of fuel. Please. Uh, I'm gonna dump this can of fuel in here real quick and might as well... <laughs> Save. Ah, sweet, delicious light. Okay, I'm gonna dump this can of fuel in the tank. And, uh... That way I can get it out of my inventory and try and find some more. Let's go this way for once. Let's go check out the soldiers' quarters. I can't see anything here.
Oh wait. Hello? Ooh. That was loud. Oh wait a minute. Prison. Okay, of course. What the fuck? Oh, mission storage. Mission storage. Okay, so that's where that tunnel leads. Prisons unlocked, dying soldiers' quarters, and communications is this way. Okay, so both both doors. Yeah. All right. Well, into the hole. Well, there's still war raging outside. Hello. Oh. Good. The fuck? I'm not trying to make noise. I'm too far away from the fucking administration building. Eek. Just once. Just one crank. Oh, sweet. Sweet. Okay. That's a grenade. I'll take that. Sure, why not? Uh. 9th of July. I do not know the time, but dusk has fallen and still, of course, no word. When I asked the sergeant, he shrugged, as if I was asking about when it might next rain. These fools around me, laughing, drinking, arguing. D do they know what I've done? D do they suspect it? I feel they must all be guilty of something. And yet, they laugh, drink, argue. God knows what I've done. I wonder if his judgment could be worse than my own. All oh, right. Hmm. Ugh. Nope. Just let me slip my fingers inside that locker there. Ooh. Fourteen. Seventy-five, seventeen. You got a locker around here? Hey! I need to find a... Oh, I know that room. That's the one I gotta get in. Okay, so they're opening another one of those... things somewhere? There's a wrench in there. Lambert. I know where... Well, hey, let... Oh, poor Lambert. Where is the locker? Excuse me? Who was it? Right? Fortin. Oh, hey, yeah, there we go. Let's see, I think it was seven five seventeen, right? Yet. I'm gonna drop this for now. I'm gonna grab as much fuel as I can before I crank it up and start dropping bombs in people's rooms. And then I can always run back and turn it off again whenever I'm done with a specific noise making objective. I guess that would be the smart way to do it. I don't know. Oh shit. Let's see. Shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, thank God it's so close I didn't realize. I don't know where exactly the fucking thing is at. All right. Eat, eat. Ugh. 
Okay. There we go. Alright, so... I think I'll keep a grenade in my inventory. At least for now. And we'll go dump these two cans in here. That should be... That should buy me a little bit of time, at least. To go... Because I'm assuming the thing doesn't like light. At least not very much. And we're gonna go crank this. See my top, my pocket watch up. That's a pretty good little chunk of fuel there. All right. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna go to that dude's room. And see about uh, getting in there. There we go. All right. Let's fucking light this bad boy. Oh, shit. Hey, dude, you have seen better days. Oh, oh great, perfect. Okay, so LaRue here from the 15th. I am now putting into writing what I've reported to both my, my immediate superiors. Last evening, 14th of May, I was assigned to aid the engineers in mapping the Roman tunnels. Entered the deepest area of the tunnels and noticed strange glowing liquid seeping from the walls. Turned around, the walls of the tunnels themselves were certainly gone, and I was standing in a vast plain of darkness. There was a sickly light in the distance that seemed to be calling me forward. Between it and me, malformed shadows moved. I blinked again, and it was gone. I was back in the tunnel. It lasted but a split second, but I am quite convinced that what I saw was no daydream. It was real. Since that experience, I have felt haunted, like a part of me is still there, stuck in the tunnels. I keep seeing shapes moving at the edges of my vision. I am formally requesting medical leave. Oh. These shapes, huh? What was that? I don't like the noises. Is his dog tags not in here? Oh, there they are. Cool. Perfect. So I can get that thing. That's great. Okay. Yeah, pull these down. Oh, shit. I don't like the way you're looking at me, pal. Eh. Give it a shove. Oh my god, I could have literally fucking... I did not have to do that. I didn't have to waste a grenade. Damn it. I should be more aware of my surroundings. Son of a bitch, that was unnecessary. That that's okay. Let's see. Can I not look at my? Still got some time. That's what I was trying to keep from happening. Ah, oh, shit. Uh. You gonna be burning for a while, or what? Yeah. Okay. I recognize this name. Ooh. That. Mm. That's not going to help you. Okay. 
All right, that was it. One bullet. Okay, pal. Easy. So I can go get... Oh! Oh! Oh, no. No, no, no. Fuck that. Shit. I got his code. I'm gonna have so many pussy saves, dude. Oh. There we go. Yeah, let's see. Oh, wait, I can't. God damn it, I can't remember what it was. 4566. 456. Six. Okay. So I'll take this. Lambert. Man, I wish I could see his code for Lambert. Didn't make it this far. Alright. So... Looks like we need... Oh, that's a lighter. That. Uh, ooh, a gas mask. That'd probably be nice. The wrench. We need Stafford because they gave me a little hint. Ooh. I didn't notice this before. Anything. There's nothing in it. Wait a minute. Is he out? Oh my fuck. Oh, son of a bitch. Dude. He is out. I can't fucking see him though. I can't see a goddamn thing. I'm in the lockdown area. Fuck. Dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> Fuck. You know what? I'm gonna leave this light on, actually, while I go fucking get that goddamn thing. Uh, because I'm taking unnecessary risks. And I need to stay alive. Okay. I mean, I, I'm not sure. I'm sure he'll probably still come out regardless, but this gives me better chance. And I can... Let's see. Four, five, six, six. I should have pulled out my revolver and put a shot in his face. That might have actually get to... I panicked. <laughs> that might have actually fucking worked. Alright. Thank you. Or did he just come out right now anyway because I got that? I don't know. But I heard his... I could only see the claw of his hand. Hello. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yes. Okay. Uh, there we go. I can actually spin spin my mouse around in circles for this one. So that unlocked prison and communications. Communications. This is the tunnels, isn't it? Got a little time. Is this where? Oh, fuck. Fuel. Ah, shit.
What is this? Power in this part of the facility is daisy chain. Shut off the power in one section in the chain. The subsequent areas will go off as well. Switches should only be turned off under extraordinary circumstances, like when I say so. Pranks and mischief will be just okay. Daisy chained. Of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be? Everything's fucking locked. Everything is locked. Just like use more power or something. Oh, hey, communications. I need a key for absolutely everything. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Were the Germans here this fucking Where is it? Oh shit. Oh! Okay. Forgot about that. I almost let it get me again. Oh god. Oh god, there's another one. Yep. Where the hell? Ugh. I have no more bullets. Oh. Oh shit. Don't you come over here? Uh, I, I don't want to go back over here though. Fuck. Fuck you. Is there anything? Shit. Okay, might as well put this away. Damn it. Still got some time. Is that a dog pack? It's a dog pack. Clement. No conscience. of July. Night. My I apologize to him. compels me now, as it failed to compel me then. I must do something, even if it costs me my own life. I must do something lest I never sleep again. I must do something or risk greeting hell itself as a relief. I must do something I go I go I go you go where oh this is where that fucker is Shit. Sure. Gonna need it for how many times I fucking. Oh, is that a bullet? That is a bullet. Let's go ahead and load him on in. Oh, try and get everything up out of this fucking room. Oh, hey. I don't have a wrench. Nothing. Okay. I ain't doing this with you again, buddy. I'm going to save my game. Put some fuel in my tank. I made a little tiny bit of progress. Finally. Oop, don't want to go in there. 
Okay. That thing is quick in those fucking things. Put you in here for now. Okay, so I've opened up communications and that other thing. Prison. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I think I'm gonna leave this one here. Actually, I think I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna leave this episode here and revisit this again uh, uh, after I've calmed my teddies. But I really like it. It's super tense, and that thing is terrifying. Uh, yeah, I don't like that. I don't like that. Uh, but anyhow, well, uh, yeah, well, uh, if you if you enjoyed this, thanks for sticking around. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did enjoy it, and uh, or just kind of stopping in. Um, I every little bit helps. So, anyhow, um, yeah, thanks for coming by, and I'll see you in the uh, in the next one. Bye bye.